So ACCC, I think, is a unique blend of uh, academic medical centers, community hospitals, um, uh, physician practices, whether it's multi-specialty or just uh, oncology-specific practices. At our cancer center, we have patients that live in an urban setting. We have patients that live in a rural setting that come from all different walks of life. And being a part of this network, being a part of this organization, enables us to learn from others who have similar uh, patient demographics. And so as a result of that, we are able to do even greater things for our patients. One of the things that we really like about ACCC is they're always looking at innovative therapies and they have this Immuno-Oncology Institute that promotes a, a best practices for developing Immuno-Oncology programs and so we look to ACCC to figure out how we can develop that program in uh, our local hospital. We were able to model our distress screening tool after the the model that was in Oncology Issues. I was able to contact the person who'd written the article to get some input. So it's really invaluable to be able to grow your own program using best practices of other programs. I think one of the greatest values that the ACCC brings to providers in the cancer community is networking to engage dialogues around the areas that create potential opportunities for growth, such as reimbursement, not only for the delivery of a therapeutic, but for the testing and helping the right people get into the room to have that dialogue to affect greater change, not only within their institution, but at a national level. I think it really uh, deepens my understanding about oncology care um, across the country, and I think they do a really great job facilitating dialogue, asking the right questions, uh, about just really, really critical issues that we have um, in the oncology space. I've been involved with ACCC going to Capitol Hill and trying to meet with uh, our representatives to figure out what their stance is on different uh, topics relevant to the oncology community. And so I feel ACCC is important in that it may have an influence uh, on how policy may develop in the future. So I hear from physicians and genetic counselors and nutritionists and nurses and other medical professionals. We also hear about, especially in this business summit meeting, we hear about things are the state of cancer in the future and how it's dependent upon current administrations and laws that are pending to be changed. One of my favorite resources at the uh, ACCC is the Financial Advocacy Boot Camp. It is this wealth of knowledge for social workers, nurses, people in the front lines, financial navigators. It teaches you basically step by step of all the different aspects and ways that we can support patients with their financial toxicity with cancer treatment. The advantage of being involved and taking advantage of the resources that ACCC has to offer is that not only does it make you a better provider or administrator or manager, it makes you more in control of that care because you're changing things rather than accepting changes that have been made. And so that is one, that's what ACCC brings to me.